What's going on guys? Welcome back to 1-B2 Fight Night with Flippy. So whoever Flippy is, uh, that's not the right button. Hang on, these stupid controls get... Oh my god, here we go. Anyway, so Flippy I think is the boss. Anyway, this is the final boss of the first world, the Green Lover World. So there is... Oh god, what's he doing now? He went to the hairdresser and got his hair coloured wrong and it's now it's green and red. Whoever goes to that combo is a bit strange. Like him. Anyway, it's one glove. Oh, now he's made this poor little dude have ear hairs longer than two meters. Look at that, and boxing gloves. It's a bit ridiculous. Anyway, so us and Croc will try to take on the boxing glove uh, ear hair strange weirdo. There we go, and we're going to try and get this. This is pretty difficult. It may seem easy, but the controls that Croc has, how you have to line him up to go straight, it's ridiculous. Alright, we're going to try and get the platform because otherwise life's too difficult. And now this part's difficult just because that red guy is a pain in the butt if he gets you. Because as soon as he touches you, you're dead and you have to start again. Alright, made it in the second round. That's always a plus, isn't it? And then those two guys, we're going to have to avoid them and jump straight onto the lava thingy. And get that one. Here we go. You ready? Um, oh, yes, buddy. Try and jump across. Jump across there. Pretty much alone to beat this game, in order to beat the game, you just have to have patience. It's not a matter of just running as fast as you can through the level and try to defeat everyone as quickly as you can, um, try to beat the Guinness World Record with the Crickus Crocker uh, level beaten. It... There we go, you ready? Just gonna hit him once, and we just jump on him and go... Bang. That's how you do it, you do that four times, and he is dead. Uh, I had to do this level quite a few times before, just trying to get good at it, because it's impossible, I swear to God. Like, first go, you won't be able to get it. It's stupidly difficult. Come on. No, that, he doesn't stop there, he keeps going. Anyway, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, you can't rush through the game. Everything in this level, you sort of have to... There we go. You sort of have to, um, take your time. If you can't run, you just got to, you know, meditate. Just, yum. Yum. No, it's a Or just hum some Lion King tunes, because that seems to work as well. It's a semya of all the knees. Semi more. Hem ya. Hem hem more way. No, some... Sorry about that. There we go. That was that. Oh, we killed him. Jeez, that was easy. Alright, guys. Uh, freaking beat him. That Lion King tune must have helped. Um, so, yeah, now it looks like he's small. What a cute little no ear haired little ladybug thing that is. You jump on Croc's nose. Watch out, Croc. He might be infected. He might have rabies. And now the bird is taking a dump on us. That is fantastic. And we got small as well. What is happening? The smaller trons hit Croc World. Sweet, so we're on the ice world now. The ice of life is the next episode. But now we're on the uh, world 2. I think there's only 4 or 5 worlds in this game. But we're on world 2. We've beaten that already. That went so fast, guys. I had heaps of fun on world 1. But now I think it's onto the harder stuff. The more difficult stuff. Yes, that is what she said. Anyway, guys, I'll catch you next time. Ooh, what do you do next time, guys? Quick top right notation. Most of all, keep on gaming. See you then, guys.